New at 11, mosque arson arrest. The St. Lucie County Sheriff's Office reports a tip from the community led detectives to Joseph Schreiber. This is the mosque once attended by the man responsible for the Pulse nightclub massacre in Orlando. And investigators say they found evidence linking the arson suspect to the crime at his home. CBS 4's Carrie Codd joins us live from Fort Pierce. Carrie. Yeah, Rick and Rudabay, the St. Lucie County Sheriff's Office said it was tips from the community as well as surveillance video from around the mosque here that led them to Joseph Schreiber. As you look at the damage, we are learning that when deputies served a search warrant at Schreiber's home, they found a motorcycle like the one in some surveillance video recovered, as well as evidence that linked him to the arson. The St. Lucie County Sheriff's Office says this man, Joseph Schreiber, is the man seen running in this surveillance video after setting fire to the Islamic Center of Fort Pierce this past Sunday, September 11th. Investigators say they not only found a motorcycle at Schreiber's home matching the one in the surveillance video, but evidence linking Schreiber to the arson. And then there were Schreiber's social media posts. An examination of Schreiber's social media account also shows multiple anti Islamic posts and comments. For instance, this post from July, which says in part that all Islam is radical and should be considered terrorists and criminals. Schreiber is charged with arson, and investigators consider this a hate crime, meaning that Schreiber could face additional time in prison. Detectives say Schreiber has a criminal history of robbery with a firearm, so with the new charges, he faces the possibility of life behind bars. Plus, the FBI says they might drop charges on him, too. As the investigation continues, we're looking into possible civil rights violations. This is what part of the mosque looks like from the inside after the fire. Wilfredo Ruiz is with CARE, the Council on American Islamic Relations. An attack in a place of worship like this, our mosque is not really an attack of a mosque, it's an attack on all the places of worship in Florida. This mosque is connected to another act of violence. Omar Mateen occasionally worshipped at this mosque. Mateen murdered 49 people at the Pulse nightclub in Orlando in June. Islamic leaders say whether it's Mateen or Schreiber, their actions sprung from the same well. It was hate. Omar Mateen had hate in his heart, and, and apparently so does uh, Joe Schreiber. Islamic leaders hope the end result of this violent act is a greater understanding of Islam and that people take the time to ask questions about the religion if they don't understand it. Mosque leaders tell us they plan to rebuild and they're already raising money for that effort. Live in Fort Pierce, Carrie Codd, CBS 4 News Tonight. Carrie, thank you.